why I hate school. Today, this bitch was just walking along and I happened to be walking behind her with my friend and she always wears short pants that her butt hangs out and today I just happened to see her tampon string hanging out. Tuesday, math. Tuesday, math. Wednesday, two periods of tourism. Then at the end of the day, two periods of business. And then on Tuesday, first period, I have business. Thursday, last period, I have business. And second period, I have mass. Friday, I have mass. You think you're hot because you don't wear underwear? Everyone can see your ass jiggle and it ain't pretty. So the certain bitches at my school that think they run the school, everything that is organised, they want to be the one that organises it. We have school photos where half of the people in our actual year aren't even in the photos, it's their friends. People are meant to be buying the yearbooks, but no one's going to want to buy it if there's only these ugly as fuck bitches that just walk around the school with barely any pants on at all. So many shit that needs to be sorted out with the school. They use the money on total shit. The chairs in the business room are just in the IT room are just horrible they hurt my back five years when I first got to the school and started year eight it was disgusting the floor has dried bubble gum from over the years that is just stuck there on every path everywhere you go there is dried bubble gum you go to sit at your desks, there is bubble gum covered underneath your desk. You make friends with people and then they just fucking dog you. A new kid comes to school and they're just their new best friend. Woo. Then you have your people that have like ADHD or something or like and they have like heaps of friends and you're just sitting there in class doing your work and they're like dumb as fuck and they're sitting in the corner making stupid sounds like or stupid sayings and you're just singing like what the fuck were you dropped on your head as a baby you have to come to school to try and get a good education and then you have those people that are making those sounds, sitting there not doing any work, wasting their fucking time at school, when they can be out getting a job or fucking getting stoned like they do on the weekend. So there was a rule made saying no iPods, no phones, nothing at the school. And we all found that really shit. And we all hated it. And many people just went against it. But then, and you were warned that if you were seen with your phone or something, it'd be confiscated in most classes. Though some classes would allow it, like math, sometimes you could use it for a calculator. But anyways, the school changed the rules this year and said, we can use our phones if the teacher says. We can use our phone at recess and lunch. I find this rule really, really fair. But people just go against it. And you're sitting in class doing your work. And there's people in there that have been told to take their earphones out. And you're just sitting there hearing all their fucking music. And their music isn't even good. It's like fucking screamo shit. Like... <laughs> Fucking shit. Fuck. 
canteen line. Fucking hell! Those fucking kids. You'll be one. They should have, like, a priority line for year 12s. But even then, you'll be waiting in line. And these year 8s are just taking their time. They come and they wait in front of you. And they all push in. All fucking, a lot of them, fucking push in in front of you. Hungry as fuck. You're standing in the line. Your fucking stomach's eating itself. And then, year 12s start doing it. Year 12s. Oh, yeah, butter, give me money. Oh, yeah, butter, I'll fucking buy your food for ya. Wait over there. And then you're just like, um, aren't you going to wait in line? That's the thing. Fuck, that's why we have a fucking queue, idiot.